The Food for People program provides millions of nutritious daily meals to children in need in India, Nepal and Ghana, opening up unprecedented opportunities. None of the bright young students from the town of Otanibi, Ghana, had ever had the chance to pursue a university education until now. I'm Kenneth Ujangwa. I'm now at the University of Ghana. I'm majoring in food process engineering. I got into the university just a just year I completed high school from Presbyterian Boys Secondary School. Initially, Students in my class, including myself, had various issues, transportation, feeding, and then all these factors lowered our concentrations in class. So students usually drop out for school. from school. The Food for People program was initiated and then we were part of the first batch of people who were, we actually started the whole program. But when this Food for People program was initiated, it brought everyone to school. And then it encouraged us to learn and then push for it because without food, how can you even concentrate in class? And so many of the people in my neighborhood wouldn't have known me, I wouldn't have even known them because you just see them around town because we were two different people, some in school and some not in school. So there wasn't any way we were going to come together to talk. So because of this program, it brought so many of us on board and now we are friends. No one would have even wondered someone from Utinibi would end up in preparing for a secondary school. From Otinibi to Presec hasn't happened before. No one has mo had moved from Otinibi to Pre Presbyterian Boys Secondary School. So I was the first person to actually enter the school and I was proud of myself. After which, surprisingly, so many of um, my juniors are now in the school. They have about four or five other people who are in the school. In 2012, Prem Rawat, founder of the Food for People program, celebrated the inauguration of the Otanibi Kitchen with local children and leaders. Kenneth was one of the students excited to be there, and he led a delegation in welcoming Prem. My name is Prem Rawat Foundation, an international NGO, and I have a child in Ghana. During the time we were about to you know, introduce him, we had this short acronym. M stands for motivation. Motivating children to arouse their interest in education. Thank you. This is the name of my child, Premba of Ghana. Ladies and gentlemen, and the future of Ghana. It'll be wonderful to be able to give you that opportunity so you can reach for the sky. That's what the importance of this is for me. This facility is here for you. For you to be able to then pay attention to those things that are important. You are important. You are important. You give this facility the importance not that this facility gives you the importance. And I hope that working together with us, you make this a success. And that it brings you benefit, that it brings you that opportunity that you need, and that you have a wonderful and prosperous life. Kenneth recently visited his old stomping grounds at the Food for People dining hall, where he reflected on how his experience with the program inspired him to pursue a degree in food process engineering, so he can help others in the same way the program helped him. I really miss the police. I really, really miss the police. I can't remember we come here around 12 for lunch, and we all eat together and then stay happy. I'm showing gratitude to the Prem Rawats foundation most especially and then the canteen staff too i remember their faces very well i'm praying that god will give them the strength to keep doing what they are doing to keep doing their hard work for us welcome welcome thank you, welcome. Thank you. Thank you. oh it's been a long time yeah. mm? 
You see, the staff, I, we all started together. Yes. And they are still yes. the same people and over here. And you have become big papa. <laughs> you are now yeah, a big, big man. Papa. Thank you. Full fledged man. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> so, why in school? Well, school is fine, everything is fine now. Oh. Yes. Today is supposed to be binge, right? Yes. Uh, yes. Okay. yes. Good. Then you really miss so us. I really miss us. You sir. really miss really us. Miss. Yeah. All I would say is keep <laughs> the good work yeah. and learn hard so that at least Utinibi school will be somewhere. Yes. Because you people have set the pace. Yes. Yes. So yes. we want you to continue. Sure. Mm -hmm. sure. So we wish you all the best of luck. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very much. I wanted to offer food process engineering. That's what I'm actually majoring right now. To be able to help my people just as they helped me in providing food for us. Yes, that's the main reason why I actually went in for food process engineering. After this course and after learning things in the university, I'll go back to the Food for People to help them because they really, really helped me. Without them, I wouldn't have been seated here. I would have dropped out of school some time ago. Auntie Joy, Auntie Rose. Auntie, bye bye. See you next time. Okay, mommy. I'll come again, mommy. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs>